Let's get started. First, let's look at our composition and imagine what kind of landscape we want to draw. It could be the city, it could be nature, it could be the sea. It's totally your choice, whatever you can imagine. Okay? All right, so for me, I'm going to draw the desert. Okay? And when we get started, we're going to start in the foreground. Okay? Our foreground is closest to the viewer, so it's going to have the most detail. All right. So first, I'm going to draw a tree. Okay. In the desert, there are Joshua trees. So this is going to be my Joshua tree. Okay. It's tall and it's got these long branches. All right. And it's got these pointy leaves at the end. Okay, and for me, I'm going to draw a ground level. Okay, so I know where my Joshua tree is, and I'm going to add some rocks. Okay, and if I want, I can shade. All right, I can turn my pencil to the side and add some shading. Okay, you can push down hard to get a darker shading or light, lightly push and get a light shading. Okay, I'll go in at the end and add more detail. Next, my middle ground. Okay, in my middle ground, that's where my viewer's eye is going to go. So when I think of a desert, I think of a cactus. Okay, so I'm going to draw my cactus, and you don't need as much detail, but that's your choice. Okay, so I've got my cactus, right? And I'm going to add my ground level again, just so I know where I'm at in the middle ground, and some rocks. Okay, and because my viewer's eye is to the middle ground, I'm going to draw a tortoise. Okay. My tortoise is just chilling in the desert. Okay. He's enjoying the sun. Okay. And I can add more detail to him later. All right, and our last part, our background. Okay, we're going to keep our background simple. Okay, I'm just going to add some mountains, and then you can also see the sky, and that'll be my background. Okay, so I can go back in, add some more detail, and then call it a day. Good luck!